That was the time. Sure. Only you do it with now. play action, and not shotgun. Right. So I wouldn't be surprised if here correctly? on this down we see some, don't see some sort of deep pass. Second down and three for the Century Patriots here. And they're gonna hand this one off to Jackson Ford. Oh, he's got the first down run. and more. He's up the sideline. And he's gonna be stopped just short of a touchdown. I think they're gonna have about one yard to go there. Jackson Ford, quick beat, and Patriots. he was out of there in a hurry. That a touchdown saving be tackle by Katie, but again. One and a half yard line for the Demons. The first and goal. Four or five carries high. that we've seen that have gone for big yardage, eight plus, have been that same hole and then cut outside to the right. It's been the same run every time that we've seen these big yardage runs. And Hayden will sneak that one in. It looks like he is, oof, no signal yet. Maybe he's just short of the touchdown. Yeah, they're marking him just a little bit short. About a half yard to Gibson go the here. Keeper. Big body is Hayden Gibson, 220 pounds, 6'3". Not exactly your uh, typical high school quarterback. Are you saying you wouldn't be shocked if that happened again? No. Another sneak? But, you know, I wouldn't be shocked if they give it to Noah DeBoard either. And there Gibson we go. That time he is in. Hayden gets it in for the touchdown, I believe. No signal yet, but he looks like he's two yards yeah, in. Looked, yeah, looked good. I was going to say, it's a pretty good push by that front line there. And the Bismarck High Demons have their first touchdown. They put six on the board here. Pretty good drive there to end this first quarter. We've only got about a minute left in this first quarter, and they they looked good. Did they? I don't think they passed a single time nope, in that series. Nope, so. we called maybe one on on uh, what could have been a little play action play there, thought maybe happened, but no. I mean, clearly, they're a downhill running team, and they ran downhill that entire series. I mean, I think the, the least the amount of yards they gained until they got to the goal line was five or six on that yep. fullback dive. So the Bismarck High Demons put seven on the board. They lead number five century seven to zero with a minute six left to go here in the first quarter. The Century Patriots will come back out with their offense. When you, when you, you know, look back at this touchdown, obviously, you know, nothing fancy here, just a little quarterback sneak, but what does that do for your team? <laughs> well, get seven points on the board. <laughs> <laughs> and I mean, right now, I mean, you know, first quarter a, mi a minute left it's a one-sided battle one team's moving one direction and the other team's moving the other and so things are going to have to change if century's going to you know get in this game scoreboard wise nothing to worry about the eye test says century's got something to do to make this a game yes We'll see if Century's offensive line here is going to be up to the task of moving some defensive bodies here, which will make a big difference, I think, so far. That's kind of been uh, what's holding them back for sure is breaking open that big hole. They've, you know, they've got some talent. They've got some great athletes on this team. They just need a little bit more to kind of surround them and be able to, you know, make the big plays and open up the holes for them. Yeah, and on offense, something has to go right. You know, the first down that they got on that last drive gets called back because of a penalty. But up until that point on that last drive, they were looking good. Hunter Johnson kicks this one deep. That's going to be received Nagurski by Nagurski. Nagurski comes out. He's going straight up the middle. Another good return by him. Bounces it off. And he's <laughs> up to about the 47-yard line. That's what you need, returning the ball, huh? Well, he's by far their best offensive weapon yes. right now. That was, a, that was a great run. I mean, guys were just bouncing right off of him. And I, you know, the best part of the play was the catch he made at the goal line because if that ball crosses the goal line, it's a touchback. Right. So he, ca yeah. I mean, I don't know if you saw it, but he caught his, kept his toes just on the goal line so he didn't cross, it didn't cross. Number 47, Dalton Sander, or Dylan Sander, Seidler, excuse me, made that tackle for the Bismarck Demons. So good field position again for the Patriots. Kraft tucks it down. Kraft on the... Yeah, there's not a lot of room no. uh, uh, on any of those runs. It was a little slow developing yep. with, Eight you know, times. the fake handoff to the outside the or whatever. It seemed like, you know, the success with sweeps carry on that one run, it was a quick hitter. Uh, it might be a way to go there. Chris Kraft, not the biggest quarterback you've ever seen. He is 6'1", 210, not exactly tiny. I think that 210 might be a little generous. 
he's crafty. Built tough, back to though, back. you know? Oh, I mean, yeah, absolutely. A, he's yeah. built like a tailback. Yeah, he's he little, is. He's Sorry, a little short for your typical ball. quarterback, but Please. he is. He's a tough kid. He's willing to take a few licks in there. He also a good defensive player, and that's really tough when you have to have your quarterback back in there on the other side of the ball. You know, it does keep, obviously, you know, your head's in the game the whole time, but a lot of extra licks and a lot of extra playing time can be tough as a quarterback as well. This is kind of a big third down at this point in the game. First century. After getting two great returns by Nagurski, they really need to punch in a first down here, keep that momentum moving. Kraft back to pass, tucks it again, room to run straight ahead, and he's going to get that out to about the. Oh, that's going to depend on the spot. I think he's going to be about a half yard, oh, maybe like six inches short. Oof, da. Ooh. <clears throat> Good spot, though. Alex Seibel on the stop for the Demons. Yep, fourth they're going to call that one fourth down, not even going to measure that one. We'll and see what they short. decide to do here. You go for it here. The oh, it's the, the quarter break quarter. here. Oh, too much time to think about it. Yep, a lot of extra time here. Again, you're watching Bismarck High take on Century here. It is seven nothing Demons after one quarter. We'll be right back. Are you here we Next, go, fourth Bismarck down. Bowl, you got it. They are going to rush that one forward. Chris Kraft. Oof. Looked like the first push was good. We'll have to see where they spot this. The yeah, he dang near got a full yard there. Yeah, I think he got it. First down, yeah. And they are going to give it to him. I was going to say that's, you know, obviously the second guy can come in and give you a little push back. But good. yeah, and there are some games that, you know, you get a feel and maybe you punt that at that point in time. But in this game tonight, nothing to lose. Right. Coach Wingenbach told us that in that spot, you got to go for it. I do, when when Kraft is in, alone back there, he's almost like he's like a wild cat on his own there. He's going to throw this one down the field way too far for Nagurski, but he was about as wide open as you get. That would have been a touchdown if that would have been on the money. It was a little bit weird watching Nagurski on the route. It's almost like he didn't know it was coming, which, but that can't be possible because the whole play was set up for that to happen. It's like he didn't quite get his head turned at the right time to see the ball um, and it was over his head. Obviously it was a little overthrown as well. That will bring up second down and 10 for the Century Patriots here as they are at the 45 yard line here. Again Bismarck High number two. They lead number five Century 7-0 here early in the second quarter from the Bismarck Community Bowl. Kraft rolling to his left. He's going to find Nagurski for a first down and they found him a couple times out there near the sideline and he's making the play. Yeah, he's open and Kraft is making good plays on the move. And uh, you know, if you watch when this, this rolls, is one of those uh, dreaded throw the while you're running across your body yeah, deals. Down. I mean, that's a heck of a throw right there. He seems he, he seems to throw his best ball when he is on the move.